Oh, bloody hell. Jesus. Jesus. Hey everybody, how you guys doing? My name is Chris Jester and welcome back to another episode of Last Train Home. And in the last episode, as you recall, we had finally reached Moscow and uh, took care of business. Unfortunately, the gentleman we were after did get away, but now our main goal is to travel along the rail line through all of this territory, as you can see, coming straight down and way over here to Penza, and we have to do so in one piece. So, that could be exciting. For those of you that are just joining and haven't seen the first episode and are curious what Last Train Home is, Essentially, it's a uh, RTS survival game where you have a top-down view of the units and you will guide them through the city in an RTS fashion. However, once you return to the train, which is kind of like your HQ, if you will, you can now go into the train and you have numerous options per the train. You gather supplies, recruit troops, you have uh, more troops that have abilities and specialties. So on the battlefield, they might be a sniper, they might be a machine gunner or an infantryman. However, on the train, now they have jobs to fulfill here as well. That sniper may be a cook, and that rifleman may be an engineer to start working on the train and get it moving while the cook takes care of everything else. So it's kind of cool in that you have the resource management and the soldiers have to go through. Um, pretty difficult, but not so difficult that it's not fun. It's a good amount of uh, RTS as well as management, but anyways, it looks like we actually are. Allocate rations wisely to keep your soldiers from going hungry. Without food, their morale deteriorates. Yes. We actually need to get some food. Train upgrades. As you sit and watch the horrors of Moscow disappear behind the horizon and ponder over your newly acquired responsibilities, Captain Langer approaches you, curiously inspecting you with his critical gaze. Quite unexpectedly, he speaks to you with a soft voice. So basically it's saying that we need to do some train upgrades. Optimize your locomotive and train cars by upgrading them. Guide. We're going to go ahead and look at individual cars, infantry, 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 storage cars. So can we upgrade the storage? We can, only when the train is not moving. Same with, okay, cool. So what we'll do is we will look at the upgrades available as soon as we get to our first area, which is going to be right around here. We're going to go ahead and get our infantry stopped right at this spot, and then we'll send out some kind of patrol to look for some supplies in and around this area. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead and stop the train. And let's get some uh, scouting parties going here. Select squad, we are going to send everybody if we can. Whoa, their health is really bad though. Some of the soldiers have status that prevents them from being deployed. So we haven't been able to heal much since the, uh, since the last one. Let's go ahead and disband the squad and create a new squad with people who are ready to rock and roll. We got our machine gunner. Looks like medic, rifleman. So medic, two riflemen, and a machine gunner. That is going to be good. Let's go ahead and confirm this squad. Let the other ones actually sleep. We're going to deploy them to Yegorizvik. And hopefully they have some beneficial stuff that they'll be able to work on. Meanwhile... Now we can actually look at these infantry cars to accommodate. So let's go ahead and go to the storage car repairs. We'll assign one worker for the repair of the locomotive. So we don't break down. Let's start looking at these infantry cars. What can we do? Repair durability. Is that all we can do right now? No. Okay, there we go. Could do some heating, some endurance, or living. I'm going to look over these really quick and see which would be the, probably the best one. Okay, so it did mention something about heating and overall comfortable living. We could, at 150 cloth, but we could also do improved insulation here, which increases the inner temperature of the train car by one level, two levels in total, because the stove consumes fuel, but we can do the insul... Hmm, yes, yeah, so let's do this. This this looks good. Working on the train is in progress, so now we're just, uh, it's just a waiting game now until we get to the next... This is going to be the next big town. Ryazan. I'm sure we're going to be coming across some uh, hostile activities here, but we'll check these two on the way back. Look at this one. This one has numerous food supplies, which is going to be great. Perfect. Got here. We've got 90 wood from this one, so let's go ahead and get them back to the base, recall them, and then we'll move on down the road here. I think that's going to be most vital. How are repairs looking? 
Everything. Look at that. That is a brand new looking train right there. I love it. So what can we do with the train then? Ah, decreased fuel burning. Decreased chance of engine malfunction. Increased raised walls. Hello. Increased the capacity of the train inventory by 1,500. And then, of course, a reinforced chassis. I thought, oh, our last train blew up. That's right. We used to have a pretty epic train with guns and everything. Now we got this uh, sorry piece of uh, garbage, unfortunately. All right, onward we go to the next town of Kolomna. Let's see how that goes. Oh, we're going, actually. Do we have a medic car? We don't have a medic car. They only increase their health ever so slightly as time goes by because we don't have the medic car, which is a damn shame. What do we have? We have the merchant, train composition, change the order of the cars in the train, and a doctor. Ooh, a local doctor willing to treat you. Oh, there we go. For a price. Boy, we could heal them all, but it would cost us 1800 Oh, and I guess I just did it without... I was going to click on them individually, but you know what? <laughs> There's the first mistake of ours. We, uh, he helped our sick at least. Well, there we go. Everyone's looking good. Merchant, how can we do this? I, now we need money. We'll go ahead and depart from here and let's go check the town of Gorodna. We have some points of interest. We still need a lot of food. This is, this is the problem. Before we reach here, we need to get food. Fortunately, there's nothing. It looks like we're going to Ryzen for the next fight. Well, let's rock and roll and get ready for this. Oh, Jesus Christ. And of course, it's before we get there, uh, as I'm reading letters, you realize there's blood on the paper and you realize you've been scratching for a few days and now there's blood, so clearly we have been infected with stuff, probably some kind of mite or something. And there's one something they want us to do about it. We can scrub the train and everything in it, or burn the clothes and anything we can be spared, because the clothes are what's going to be harboring. Scrub the train and everything in it. You know what? Let's get a good wash, because we can't burn it, the clothes. We're going to... All the clothing, bedding, and textiles found on the train are gathered and washed. A lot of effort is spent dusting and wiping every surface. The train is almost speckless. And the soldiers, though exhausted and cold, are proud of the work. Sadly, maintaining this level of hygiene is difficult, so the scabies soon return. But the stunt resulted in some good memories. Oh, great. Just great. So we need to... Ultimately, we need to burn. Train is stopping. There we go. Too many to count. Oh, Jesus. So apparently the Reds have a huge camp where they're training new recruits and they want us to send a squad to the Reds military camp. Now, why would you want us to do that? Not only that, but the Reds mil army that they found about here is rising where we're at. The Red army camp is way over here. What the hell? All right. So it looks like we've arrived at uh, the Ryesk and we've been tasked with going to this village over here and... I guess I'm, I'm assuming attacking the Reds because they're, of course, no surprise, right? Giving everybody a hard time, so we're going to go ahead and get everything rocking and rolling here. We've got our medic, machine gunner. Naturally, we're going to need some more people, though. We're going to go ahead and get another machine gunner and another medic to go through with that. Go ahead and deploy, and let's go have ourselves a fight, shall we? There we go. Start the mission. Difficulty, easy. Lots of things to do. The fence, some crates, some wolves. So let's go. Baba Yaga. Baba Yaga? Ha. I'm not doing the do with Baba Yaga. We're going to go ahead and pick up this repair kit over here. And let's start getting to work, God bless it. Repair these fences. Make it all look nice. And as you can see, there's actually uh, there's supplies that we can go and pick up over here, too. So we're actually going to repair, and then we're just going to go ahead and sneak over here when nobody's looking and steal any and all supplies that we can find. Bizarre. Look at that. That works for me. They're fixed. We got three splinters, two sore thumbs, and one bruised ego. You know what? Works out, though. Let's focus on, uh... Let's focus on all these supplies that we're going to need. Is that food? Oh, it's metal. Okay, 
rozkazy? Přesně tak. To by šlo. Co se dě... Hledám kryt. There we go, bring these crates Nechajte back here, drop them off over here. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile... Vyrážam. You ano. three, get over here, let's go see what else we can do right now. Ano. Seberu všechno, co najdu. Get these explosive grenades as well as the metal. Absolutely. Ros ano. Dobře, jdu tam. Mm -hmm. Podíváme se, co je uvnitř. Perfect. Na cestě. Look at that. See? Připraven. Who needs the reds when you got us? Not too terribly sure where the church is at this point, but we're going to have to find it if we want to have any... Ah, oh, there's the church. Beautiful. Beautiful. We're going to need a key for this area. Well, beautiful. Well, as soon as this guy gets up here with the uh, water, we also have the wolves that are down here now that we have to go deal with. I'm assuming these are the wolves, right? Well, here's one dead. Yeah, this is definitely the wolf. Definitely the wolves' lair. I feel bad though, running around. We have no capable nails, and here we are stealing all of their bloody cloth and metal. May God bless you, legionnaires, as he blesses this water and his infinite wisdom. Well, there we go. Do we get a key to the area over here with this precious metal? Hello. There it is. Look at that. Hell yeah. Unlock, let's rock and roll. We could use some food, guy. I don't need all this ammo, cloth, and metal. All right, let's go take care of the wolves and uh, call it a day, shall we? Clearly by this red banner somewhere. There we go. Jesus. Take him out, gentlemen. Take him out. Mr. Machine Gunner didn't do too well. And now we gotta find the lost bloody villager. Well, we'll find the lost villager, but you know what? We gotta get our guy back to uh, a pretty injured lady. We don't have time for this bullshit. We'll have to heal him. I wonder how much the doctor's gonna want to actually heal him. That's gonna cost some uh, pretty good money, actually. Ano. Oh, bloody hell! Jesus! ho dozad. Holy shit! Jsou to divoká zvířata. Dvounozí vlci s červenou srstí. Jejich dílo už jsme viděli. Chtějí všechny zabít a vypálit vesnici. Neopravil jsem ten plod jen proto, aby zhoršil. Dajte mi pár granátů, alebo guľomet, a já červený ukážu. All right, let's rock and roll. We got to get down here and be their shield, as they say. Do tam. Villagers, get back for God's sakes. Víš, myslíte? Rozumím. Pane? You, over here, quickly. Quickly, quickly. You, over here. You, watch over here. You three, over here. Jesus, we're getting fucking murdered. He's downed. We need a grenade, is what we bloody need. Change, 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 come on. Resupply, resupply, go, 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 go. Oh, without those grenades. Kind of a pain in the ass, wasn't it? And it looks like they're up north too now. Yeah, they are. Jesus. Come on. Get up here, you guys. Medic. 
to stabilize quickly. Ano, pane. Ano. Kryjem se. Rozkladám. Připraven. Hledám kryt. Počuvám. Rozumím. Rozkazy, pane. Pane, jdu na pozici. Já to nechápu. Nemali by červený ponuknout jedinčanou pomoc? Ano, je to strange, možná jim někdo řekl, že jsme tady. Nebo možná chtěli všem ukázat, co se stane, když si v téhle občanské válce nevyberou tu správnou stranu. Kapitán Langer bude vědět, co dál. Jdeme! We got our guy stabilized, ready to rock and roll. And we also need to get to the exit. How many villagers were lost? I hope not a lot. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. I wish I could have done better for you. But we gotta get the hell out of here and get to the exit. Finally getting here. You gotta love the machine gunners, man. When they are set up and ready to rock and roll, they are disgusting. Let me tell you. Everybody here, six of six, confirm. Exit the mission area. Hell yeah. Bloody good work. Good bloody work. All right, what have we got? We got all sorts of promotions going on, which is very nice. Oh, you know what? Is it time for the uh, awards? It is, actually. All right, who do we want upgraded then? Medics, always. Machine gunners, I mean, I would love to see machine gunners go. Let's get our machine gunner, Antonin, and I, I don't know who else. Our other medic. Good bloody work, everybody. Overview though, resources gained, 150 metal, 250 cloth, oh excuse me, 150 fuel and 100 metal. And we also got some rifle ammo, explosive grenades, and medical kit. Not bad overall, let me tell you, victory, another day, another victory, you may have doubts and worries, but for a moment all there is is a sense of triumph. You savor that feeling before going back to the streak reality of your impossible journey. Health is on the way, completed! Woo! All right. Squad returning. Soldier status prevents deployment. Rank up. Lance Corporal. So they're all ranked up, which is great. And we'll focus on the rest. Just get back to the train for right now. We gotta start getting these guys actually healed. That is what's most important right now. And hopefully, uh, Ryash has a doctor that we can look into right now. Perfect. Go ahead and pause. Ryesh, doctor. There is a doctor. The local doctor is offered to treat your sick or injured perfect. However, the doctor can spare time and resources to treat serious injuries only. Both factions in the Civil War are aggressively recruiting doctors for their own purpose. Okay. Ugh, I don't have 900. I don't have 900. Can I just choose... So, here's something I don't like, is that he can only heal soldiers with negative statuses i get that however it wants to throw all of them in the pool so you have to heal all of them at once but i don't want that what if i only wanted to heal because these two are a little bit above half health each right but if i only wanted to heal Antonin in here i'd love to have that option and i don't see that i can have that option i have to upgrade all three or do all three i don't like that i hope that's something they might change in the alpha or actually the, the main build, but I, I would like to see that changed. All right, so what have we accomplished so far? We have gotten roughly halfway to our point of Penza. Next, we're going to be hitting up the Red Army Camp, definitely. And then numerous resources along the way. I'm assuming this is going to be the end of the uh, demo here. That would be my guess. But I think what we'll do is we'll end the game here. I hope you guys have been enjoying this episode. Please comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of this so far. If you'd like to see this full release and me purchase this game and do a, a full series on this. Uh, likewise, please hit that thumbs up button if you enjoyed it. It helps me out and helps this video out. Get out to many others. And if you are new to the channel and want to see more, please hit that subscribe button. Getting more videos out to you guys on the regular, but I'm gonna get back at it. And until next time, I hope you guys have an incredible day. Take it easy, all right?